Good morning! It is Fun Facts Friday, and this week's fun fact, we're going to keep in the festive mood. This week, we're going to talk about the U.S. Capitol Christmas Tree. Every year, a special Christmas tree is picked to sit on the U.S. Capitol's lawn. This year, Colorado got that chance. Not only is Colorado's tree there representing our state, the decorations of the tree are all handmade here in Colorado by lots of people that participated. That tells the story of Colorado and what we represent. It is truly a special occasion and it's a really neat sight to see. The U.S. Capitol Christmas tree, or what they call the People's Tree, started in 1964 by the Speaker of the House, Representative John McCormick. He planted a Christmas tree there, and it was there for about four years before it's finally succumbed to all the weather and wind of the area. After that, they decided to pick a national forest in the United States each year to represent the U.S. <laughs> with its Christmas tree. Colorado has been picked four times to represent the United States with their Christmas tree. In the year 1990, the year 2000, the year 2012, and of course this very special year of 2020. This magical Christmas tree was uh, grown in the Uncompandre National Forest and it is a huge Engelman spruce tree that was 50 feet, 55 feet tall. That's a tongue twister. And it was 82 years old. It now graces the lawn of the U.S. Capitol. You can see pictures of it on their Facebook page, and you can uh, Google it and see videos of it from Colorado. If you enjoyed this video, please press the like button and subscribe so that you can get these fun facts every Friday into your email box. And have a fun and relaxed last weekend before Christmas.